I think one of the key needs that this project is responding to is uh, to avoid the temptation to find a single solution to what education for sustainable development might mean. There isn't a single solution, but each individual needs to be helped and supported in developing the range of tools and knowledge that they need to find their path to playing a role in a sustainable future. And therefore, it's a very active need it's responding to. It's about enabling individuals to do things differently rather than giving them solutions and a series of cunning plans they just have to follow. I think what's been encouraging about the pilot approaches in the universities for this project is that there hasn't been a one-size-fits-all that each of the institutions, as I understand it, has actually identified what the connection between a very common set of sustainability drivers, uh, a common set of economic pressures, resource pressures, social pressures and other changes, but for their particular institution, what's the unique characteristic or set of characteristics that their learning and teaching and staff development processes need to respond to? So I found it very encouraging, actually, that the pilots have all taken different approaches to trying to link education for sustainability and quality assurance. 